So, my name is Curse of Us, and um, so I heard that there's this is the right, this is the point supposed to be the last week. So I don't know what will happen, and I thought instead of making two videos about how I feel about um, you know about Wolverine Two and how I feel about this, I thought we're just doing the one bundle. But we'll do that after we're done with this because this is the last week. And uh I don't know I've heard a lot of things I heard a few people heard a few people saying, including both, that some of the story is um doo doo or was dog shit. He again I knew he like I know for a fact that he said some of it he liked some part of it. So I am not really truly convinced if this is gonna be one of the best Ferrari seasons, but we're going to try again anyway, and we're going to see if this one will can pay off. And because, one, I don't trust how, I don't trust really anything from every season's Ferrari for every final week is going to be great, because every time it comes great, when it comes to the final week, it's always shit happening. So, we are going to play this out nice and carefully and we're going to hope to god it turned out good because I want to see it myself now I haven't watched anything, I haven't watched anyone's um perspectives that, wait, that they want to play for on it because again I don't really trust the don't want to like, know anything about it so, yeah, so it's going to be a bit of a bitch, but we'll see. I'm a bit worried about it, though. Uh, let's see, we just put... Ah, uh, my trusted hand cannon. Do a bit hand cannon. Um, anyway, let's go. The final titties. Did I call it? And here's Krusty. Lies built on lies. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The predictions of the dead witch that I would take her bargain, unseat her sister, serve her deceptions to survive the witness. That my fate is not my own. Did she learn nothing from the traveler? Any rule can be unseated by a choice. <laughs> See, this is the point where I don't trust her, how it would just put a bullet to, to her head. I am not an archite, I'm a fucking exo and a guardian. The blood whispers, Asa's mewling suffer song, the venom surge behind my eyes. This will be our final tide. I'm fun bay for on the street. Ah, what was it? Ah. Okay. Okay, time to complete a spire. Which is going to be a pain in the fucking tent because I don't know what will happen. So we're going to have a wee quick peek. Uh, see what does it have? Solar? Ooh. This is shit. And void threat. Yeah, I'm sticking with void. I mean, stasis. I'm solar. I mean, fuck. Anyway. Okay, let's get this over with. Final week. Um, pretty much, I do. I, I don't go wrong. I just want to say some part. Of it. Some of the weeks in this uh, season was great, but the only problem was that the thing that pissed me off was doing some of the weeks with three times of it to get the achievement. Right? I hate fetch quests. And it felt like a fetch quest to me. Right? 
So, eh, I'm not a big fan of it, but I am hoping the fact that, um, <coughs> I'm kind of like hoping a bit of a way that after this part we done, I'm hoping that the fact that we can get by and ho truly hope the fact that the ending is going to let me see Savathun. Because I, I, don't go wrong, when I heard the actress, like the voice actress who was doing Savathun, she was great. That's why I can't wait to hear more from her. I don't know if they changed, it, changed the voice, actor, but voice actress, but I don't know. But I hope they keep the original, because she was cool. Ascend the spire and hone your magic. Yeah, 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 Chloe. You even more stupid. Stupid bastard. But anyway, I, I, I do like some of the storyline uh, that people were kind of like untrusting. Oh, that was my ball. Um, punk. I'm just messing around. But I do know that uh, there was a few good number of people who kind of didn't trust her, or some people had faith in her, which it was a pile of fucking jokes. I don't believe in that. Which is that? That's funny. And I fall off the fucking edge. But <clears throat> with that being said, I'm never gonna write ball for. I'm never gonna be a big fan of some of it. was one. But I really do hope something really happens to her, and I always end up wishing that because I don't like her. She's ugly. I hate when someone's mess messing about with fucking high crap magic. Become crusty. Not my thing. You know? Never my thing. But, uh, so far I do like the fact that it always works out for her, but I always hope that one day it kind of won't work well. Because she's a bitch, and I don't like playing, helping out a uh, stupid, uh, stupid uh, character with hype shit. Never have a big, I never have a big fan. A big fan of ours. Cade, however, he was cool. But hey, what can I know? It's just that because I know Elsie was right saying, "Oh, she, don't trust her. She's evil. You don't know what she will, what she will do and all that." And I thought, "Ah, oh, well." <laughs> blame, blame the vanguard for being stupid. <coughs> but. At least it was kind of like saying, "Oh, we need her to. We need. To, we need to do this for to try and wake up Savathun." And I'm like, "Ooh, moth lady, moth mummy, moth mummy, mummy." Never said moth milk. I said moth mummy. mummy. So there, there is like, an interesting kind of like, effect, you know, and. To be honest with you, since this is the final week, I can finally do whatever I want. Because the... I was going to go back and try the... Embarrowed engine, but I don't really like fucking puzzle missions. And I think they're stupid. So, thanks a lot Bungie for... For... Annoying me with your crap puzzles. Um, 
we are not in puzzles because I really don't fucking like the puzzle because uh, it drives me insane but <coughs> oh you fuck are you fuck Ooh. but besides the point <coughs> I don't mind doing this kind of stuff or doing the yellow doing the altar can I eat fuel because good god that one that shit was amazing you know that shit was great kind of reminds me of um, the thing in Oryx he said drift not Crystal to its vessel. But end of the day, it's always going to be more. Oh, fetch quest. So I'm hoping the next season is going to be like you know, epic and actual fun, not fetch quests, because. I don't like fetch quests, and if it's going to keep on doing that, then I'm just going to keep giving it like a 5. Keep giving it a 5 or even less, because I'm that evil. And I would be happy to be even, being evil. You know, I would be happy to take it. You and your But um the other thing is when it comes to like other games right and stuff, it's nice to have a break from destiny. Like try out games I never played before. For example, with the two, I will talk about how I feel about the game in general. Um, <coughs> just to get, to get you guys heads up about it. Wait. Wait. Wait but for saying that, I will be. Uh, Going to try out other games and stuff, similar to that one, but I might go back and go back to the games I played before. You think you know? Eris will finally lose her marbles? She seems short of two when she started. This might be the thing that finally knocks him loose. Enough. What? I hear how your guardians talk. They ain't exactly discreet. We trust Eris to get this done. <laughs> no, you do, of course. I don't. You might want to check your comms because that's not what I'm here. I'm only there for the raid. You dumb bitch. Every time, why does that harm my fucking takes my health off? Stupid. Body banner? Nothing? Ah, okay. I'm gonna get a bottle with that. Heh. Big up, big up. You brought Sego here. Now clear these death packets out. Hey, at least we get the easy one. I'm happy with that shit. Uh oh. But. Going back to. This game, the, uh, again, I still enjoy it, but does I am well, 
I'm, I'm a bit annoyed. Wait for it, half of the time. Wait, I get triggered, I get all fucking mad about the whole thing. Yeah. But I do want to go back into it again, wait, more in this game. Like, right, otherwise, playing, I don't know. Like, um. Uh, Uh, playing like, I don't know. Um. Like, uh. Um. What will be the best term? Oh, yeah, going back to do raids. You know, or may I not wait until when Final Shape comes out and wait for the new system, the new waiting system, which I heard is supposed to be cool. Cause that's what you could fuck sick. Um, <coughs> like you know, for to play uh, it it will bump up, it will bump up the light level for yourself, so it makes it easier, I think. Back off, Captain. Scripture to that end. I believe it is all she knows. I thought it would be like a. Uh, see if we can find any heavy. But, here we go. Now we're gonna go and deal with the other fucking problem. Yeah. <sighs> Happy fucking days. Oh, great. Oh, more receiving crap messages. Cool. Alright. Yeah, this is great. Ha, he niat. Niat. Whatever you want to call that crap, she said. But yeah, I want to get back into raiding. I want to get back into, like, just casual, fun time playing raiding. Just see how many attempts it takes us, right, you know, it takes me or, like, takes us to beat it and all that. I don't want to, like, beat it fast or whatever, I just want to have fun, you know? And I kind of do miss playing with Raze with my, with my teammates. Again, we haven't really had much in the clan, but, you know, big, big number of us, but... <coughs> This is it, Guardian. Eris consulted her cards one last time, and departed for the Oubliette in Sabathun's throne world. She awaits your final tithe. Oh, you mean my final she tit? Left, she asked me to ready something for Transmat from the tower security vault. And I agreed. Everything is on the line. Asa, the Vanguard, the fate of the soul system and beyond. See, Arsa doesn't does want to get involved in this, and I don't know why they gave, the the, they thought, oh, let's bring Arsa back while she and went through some random all crap. All to do is get out of her way. That was an evil move from Eris, from Eris 1. 
he doesn't need the big fish. Just saying. It's kind of stupid. Okay. To the shunder. I will first. I'm going to go in. I am going in to get my crap because I do not want to come back here until I'm done. Yeah, I got a sniper. Not a camera, but him. That would be late. Right. No sniper. Yeah. Oh, I'm being a little bit tired today, so that's why I'm all but like viewing shit and stuff. And I'm never going back into this. I don't care about the the car, the challenges, or whatever. After unlocking this, I'm done with it. I'm not messing about with that crap. Um, wait, mission Sunder. So. Now, I have a funny feeling we're going to meet um, that big champion lookalike thing, the one that looks like from Fire Quarter. Eris is ready for the final tithing ritual. This <coughs> is the last and best opportunity to deal a real blow to Zebul Wrath. I know this may seem like a long shot, but we have to trust in Eris. She made herself for this moment. You both did. No, you mean she did, not me. Alright, here we go. It's been fun watching you play Hive, but this has gotten out of hand. You activate the Obliette again, and Zivu's goons are gonna go full Tora Bottle on this place. You lack imagination, Underling. You shall soon witness the consequences of your master's apostasy. Eris, it's not Sabafun you're dealing with, it's the stupid big mouth, big all capitals bitch you're dealing with. Not fucking say it, Sava, you stupid. Ooh. I wish I'd just do that and just wait, pop ahead after we've done the title. You know, after. Zivu's calling up the Leviathan Eater. He's been around since Fundament. A real heavy hitter. I'm getting out of here, and you should too. Stick around and you'll end up a grease stain. You will go nowhere. This is the culmination of the bargain you proposed. You will witness our triumph, or perish as one of us. <sighs> I feel I feel sorry for Rejoice, worshipper. You have I am not your worshipper. You can get that. You can get yourself. You're just a mad freaking winnie. Winnie winnie. See if that my cursor was not green. Oh, I would fuck him. <laughs> I would. F I. I hate this. I hate her so bad. But at least the season was great. It is over. Oh. Eh. Raise my sister's court and tie the ashes to thy Oh. It's the reviving Eater. Boom, boom, boom. <laughs> I'm just really blasting them. Ma, pussy! You know why I come out? You know why I charge? Oh, now you're moving. Took you for long enough, didn't it? Oh, 
Oh, fuck. Oh, sorry. Sorry. My mistake. And... I'm glad you're with me, Iris, but can you do something? I don't know. Shoot back. Use your tie... Or titty magic, or whatever you want to call it. Um, I don't know. Shoot back. Anything. Surrounded by ugly crab people. Fuck. Right, that smoked them. Come on. There we go. That's more like it. Okay, what I need to do? Uh, oh, okay, so see. Yahoo! What the go? Don't mind me, I'm just eating your hot and eating your spicy Cheeto. So don't worry, you can have it back after I take your second part of your help off. Jump like a bitch. Hey, right. one down, one draw. Oh, we hit bonk. Oh, another one. Bonk. Ooh. I'm glad they don't harm me anymore because I remember that when on the boss week that somehow this harms you, and I'm like. And then suddenly it just turns back to normal. Wait, what the hell? No, you don't. Oh, God of War, you boy. Fuck. Oh, another one. Wait, where did you go? Where did you go? Oh, wait. Get it up. God, you are beefy bitch. Eat us. Okay, this is bullshit. This is bullshit. No! You ain't killing me! Not today, boy! Shmeddy little axe! Oh, for fuck's sake, I keep... See, this is why I like the tiny hammer, because... It's gonna burn out. But I'm... Fucking suck it! Something you stupid bitch. Oh. Hey, right, we we were kind of wiggling his help off a little bit. But I kinda like more, I like more when we shot. This may be not a shot to everybody, but hey, still me. Dunk.
But he's not like aggressive at me yet, which I don't like. Again, I... Oh shit. Uh, you don't mind if I grab my hammer, will you? Oh! Fuck you! Turn to the sucker? Okay. Oh great. Great. Cool. I got covered in stunk. Into stunk. Nope. Nope. No 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 Fuck up! You're not having me. I'm not gonna die by a stink or a boring freaking waste. Yeah, keep me warm. Yeah. Come on. What you got? Huh? What you got? Boop. Boop. Yeah, 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 yeah. You can get me. Ah, you let hole. Oh. Oh. Uh, Come on. Yeah, you take that. Eat your lumps. No. <laughs> you stupid! <laughs> yes, get cocked. Why am I jumping? Wait, you know what? Oh, oh no, oh no! Angry fireman. Harris, shut up! I'm doing my job here. No. No tornado. And I missed. That was my last shot and all. I wanna be epic. Wait, is he? Why is he like tethered in a way? But I am. Oh, what? I am very confused. It looks like he's tethered. No, he's not. <coughs> oh wait, no, he is again. What? What?
Oh, for fuck's sake! Thank you. No! I'm up. Fuck. Oh, Jesus. We do. No, chair. Bonk. Quite us. Yeah, you see, he's got a better reach than me with that. I wish I had that. Oh, oh you want to play fire with fire, eh? Alright. Come on. Stink. Filthy. No love for me. Fuck you! Oh! Hey Bungie, you you watching my data feed? This is this is how I look at your hive. Hate them. Stink. Stink. Now if you hurt. I really don't like her anyway. But uh, at least we did it. And as long as us is alive, I'm happy. I don't want to have, I don't want, I like fish. I, 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 like, I like that big alien fish. But I don't want it to happen to her. So, yay, here we go. <coughs> I've arranged the transmat, but once she's here, we'll lose containment. We can't go back on this one. One last atrocity. <laughs> this wasn't the agreement. Zivu is still a threat! Do it! You will not have another chance! My favorite boss, my favorite enemy type. I like her. There is Morn. Finally out of her shell. It looks good on you, honey. I am your ruin. Savathun has not been killed by a hive since she lost her worm. Stored eons of potent lies and deceit. All Savathun's power, plus the tithes of the Guardians. Eris Morn is the strongest hive there has ever been. Yeah, and that's a big mistake. Hear me, dead things. I let this moment pass unnamed, without song. This is the rejection of your sad legacy. Zivu Araf, agitator, fomenter. What a world, sis, you have built from your conquests. No more. Now and forever, you are banished. I ought. Good, now shoot her. I don't like her. That's it. Wait. Oh, you looking good, honey. I am your wife. Wait. What? What? What the fuck? Wait. Who knows? Maybe we might get an extra cutscene. Maybe. Because, I'm sorry, that was short. That wasn't kind of like well written. Because I was kind of hoping, yay. 
Sure, so it's, you know, kill it on the spot and then somehow you see Maru getting her back up again just to prove a point and hopefully we're going to get information. But I thought the whole idea was bring her back and fucking, I don't know, tell us about how to go in to this stupid ass portal it's this stupid portal right here. I was going to say PJJ, but no. But <coughs> that what the that's stupid. Right, where are you going now? Don't tell me in the butthole. Yeah, in the stinky butthole. I'm sorry. That I'm not happy with that. Who knows? Maybe, maybe we can get back to no. It can we go normal? I don't know, but we'll see. Is she still going to be crusty? Oh, she's half crusty. It is done. Yeah. When I killed Savathun, I claimed her eons of stored power. For a moment, I surpassed even Zivu Arath herself. Yeah, yeah. The macabre gifts of the hive awaited a pitted plain of open graves. Nah, uh, was one of them yours? It was magnificent. I rejected them all. Instead of challenging Zivu Arath, I severed her connection to her throne world. She is mortal now, wherever she may be. Mortal and furious. Refusing conflict split my ritual's foul call. The tithes drained from me, and now here I stand. A woman who was briefly a god. Ikora tells me Amaru resurrected Savathun. She fled, but left Amaru here as my ward. Oh god, I feel and sorry for Amaru already. Suffering for me to destroy if Savathun moves against us. But I am weary of destruction. Hey, what about us, sir? You to explore Savathun's throne world, as the Queen of Lies is never to be fully trusted. But for now, I would like only tea, tea, and well, science. you know where the kitchen is, because I ain't getting your tea. Do it yourself. Alright, what else? Mess oh, radio message from the helm. Okay. Okay, so in some point of that text, we found out that now Savathun's are back alive, life and kicking, but she fed him with Maru behind, which was stupid. This is still buggy. There we go. <coughs> and, uh, yeah, so. Let's we'll see what happens. Regarding our ongoing attempts to breach the extraspatial portal within the Traveler, I'm relieved to report that Eris's risky plan worked. Her final ritual banished Zebu Arath from her own throne world. The Hive God of War is vulnerable for the first time in millennia. When the time comes, we can finally force a decisive engagement against her. But first, we have to deal with the Witness. To that end, Seems the Witch Queen held up her end of the bargain. I didn't want to let her go. But Savathun offered some enticing collateral. She left Amaru in Vanguard custody. He's an odious little wretch, but an important one. As long as we control the Witch Queen's connection to the light, she'll think twice before crossing us. It went against my every instinct to let Savathun squirm away again. But we need to keep our attention on that portal. She gave us the secret to breaching it. Now, we just need to discover what form it's taken. Yeah, but guess what? That will be Asa in the next season. In hibernation, and Eris is Which is going to be shit. More than that, she's thriving. I was worried that Eris's obsession with the Hive would overwhelm her. But she's carrying herself with an air of confidence I haven't seen in a century. And I'm just glad to see her happy. Okay. So. 
out of all the... Oh, out of everything that we've done. Um, it was okay. I was a little bit mad with the fact that, um, well, you know, <coughs> um, how that was kind of shortened. Um, sure, the, some most of the weeks it, in that was kind of okay. I, I like the new idea with the map, the missions and stuff. Um, but the one thing it annoyed me so bad was the. Um, and apparently we need to rest our rank, we set our rank, so that's the one I'm going to do, because I want to get that ship. But, um, yeah, so, so far I don't mind it, man, it wasn't like great, great, it wasn't like really great, except for that ending was, to me, I was hoping to see more cutscene text, more cutscene with uh, subtitle text. But, now, we got that out the way, and now Salafin is, right, gave all the, all, all the secrets and all the information, which is kind of happy that Salafin uh, is, right, buggered off again, which I really don't care about. But, now we got that. But, guess what? We had to wait for another whole fucking expansion. So, like I was saying, this season is alright. I'll give it a s 7. out of 10, right? I'll give it a 7 out of 10. Now, the wheel thing, I don't kind of like, and it was, it's still bugging me to this day, is the fetch quest and all that, and the, the ultimate, ultimate, or ultimate, or whatever you want to call it. Um, <coughs> like, I don't really like how to go one into Serpent's um, phone world, and kill a bunch of shit and then going into a war sector looking for puzzle pieces and then do that sure they were kind of cool if that they changed up a little bit which was fine but half of the time i got so burnt out i was feeling a bit tired i was just about going to fall asleep on my um on my chair and then probably just drop my controller like an idiot but it was all it, again some of the weeks after that was kind of up again. I'm never. I, I don't know how to work with the the um, engine mission, the embargo mission engine. Because um, again, I don't know how things work with that. I never even completed anything on it. If I if, if I don't recall. Um. So yeah. Uh. So far, it was alright. So I'll give it like either between a 5 out of 10 or a 7 out of 10, but I'll probably give it a 7 out of 10. So, now, <clears throat> out that out the way, let's talk about, well, we have a little bit of time left, because again, I will have to end this video. Um, let's talk about other future gaming. Now, I know one, I know, um, from the big amount of comments that's been asking me about Call of Duty. I am going to get it. It's just that I'm going to have to just wait for a little bit. Because I don't get... I, I don't got enough to be able to do that. So that's why um, I made a promise to myself. I will be sorting out with stuff from about from between... From once it gets to next week. And once it gets to... Because um, after all, you know it's I'm gonna be um, spending time with my mom to for a birthday, so that's another thing I'm gonna be doing. Um, <coughs> and uh, I'm gonna be like doing that because I want to get have a wee day out. I want to try and have hopefully the weather's gonna be be alright. But wait, now I'm looking at the window. I'm looking at my own window and it was downpouring like hell. So hopefully next week we'll be kind of calmed down a bit. Um, so yeah, I want to spend time with Mom's birthday to get her some gifts and stuff and get some present, get some, uh, get some stuff over 
and also helping one house. Because again, it's been a nightmare of trying to like, write down a list of games, what to play, what to get, and what ones I should get when it comes to. Now, going back from Call of Duty, I will be getting it at some point, but it'll be in a later date. If I can get it, I can get it. Now, that's that. Now, there's a few other games, right? Lords of the Fallen. Now, since I s promised myself I, if I beat Revenant 2, I would go and play Lords of the Fallen. And a part of me wanted me to go and play and get Lies of Pete. After watching three videos of it, um, quite lengthy videos, I've been watching Maximilian Dude because he's an expert. He, to me, he's a master of Soul Lake games, so I highly like watch it. I would highly recommend watch his if you, if you if you know him or seen his videos about. Um, and I've been like learning a little bit of way, like from you know of way how you handle with certain enemies and stuff and it kind of and all, and getting seeing what kind of weapons you can get and what other stuff and <clears throat> I want to go back in I want to get back into so like more so like types of games because after all since I played Revenant 2 and didn't really completely wage out and I did wage a wee bit you know just that little twist it can annoy me a little bit you know, so I am going to go back and I'm probably try and play some Soul Lake games. I'm not going back to the older ones. If you're thinking about Dark Souls 3 or whatnot or Bloodborne, I ain't touching them. So that's a failed attempt play through that me losing my shit. And I do not want to go and we do the whole thing and me probably thinking that I'm going to end up losing my shit again and I don't want to do that so these two were just failed let's plays so if you find them you will see why on the channel and you'll but you'll be surprised if you watch from Elden Ring I was completely calm all the way sure I was a little bit triggered a little bit but I wasn't completely mad <coughs> sorry um <clears throat> So yeah, I want to get, I, I want, I want to try and get Liza P in uh, Lords of the Fallen. Now there is another game that it's been part of getting mentioned in the co in the comment section. It's Spider Man Two, right? Um, or m the way my friend calls them, Jeff and Bob, or Jeff and Dean. Just or Jeff and Bob. But anyway, Spider Man Two. I am going to try and get that as well, but the only real catch is, again, it's the same issue like I, like, from, like, um, from, like, uh, for, like I said about record, it's, that's going to be a bit of a problem. So, there is that, but I will, I will get them, and I will find a way to get them, somehow. Um, <coughs> that goes with... Tekken 8 and what was the oh yeah Pan, uh, Avatar Pandora because um, I want to play that as well I want to get a white good feel for that because I want to play an actual Avatar game the only time I've seen an Avatar game like the old ones was well, the old one was that was on the PlayStation 3 and I wasn't really too sure about it at first until I watched a full playthrough of it and I thought well, that was kind of cool so there's that too So, yeah, um, there is these types of games I want to get my hands on. Uh, there's like some major good stuff I want to try and get. Um, right now, I'm basically going back to a stump because right now I don't have any other games to play unless I can try and convince Fear and my other friend to stay in the game on Weapon 2 and do that Lambert dungeon because I really want to get him i get a funny reaction out of him you know just to see what how he handles it because there's going to be either that and there's also going to be where the Lambert is so I'm going to try and work my hardest to try and get him to stay in or, or lure him in there to see how he feels right so <clears throat> 
there's that to there's I am going to go back on Optimum ba Epic Battles Simulator 2. Uh, right now I'm picking out certain other mod characters because again I've been right testing them. See what ways I can get rid of that God Emperor but um um uh, model uh unit because there is a God Emperor from Warhammer and I've been trying to find ways to annihilate him and crush him and see how much he can hold. So there is that and I wanna get my I wanna try and beat him, I wanna try and see if I can like break the break him one way or the other. But uh yeah. So <coughs> If there's any de- I like I am gonna say this again, if there's any demos or any, like, free to play games or anything, or any other content that you saw on the channel, or you see it on the PlayStation Store, or which army you wanna see, you wanna see in the Epic Ultimate Simulator, Ultimate Battle Simulator 2, um, which armies you wanna see, write them down in the comments below. Um, again, I'm basically gonna be try and put in like a few ideas i might not upload all the time but i will try and get like a few videos out because <coughs> as you as you all know tomorrow next week on the 13th i'm going to be recovering because i'm going to have my um i'm going to like go and get my front tooth fixed so and that's going to be a pain in the ass to recover, so uh, that's why I'm going to try and get enough videos out the road. And since Friday the third is it's going to be the thirteenth, it's an unlucky day for me to go into the dentist to go and get my teeth repaired. So yay, I can't wait to be spooked. Yay! But for that being said, I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Um, sorry for ranting and rambling on about how I feel about with Destiny. I know there's going to be lore about, like, if I, hang on, if there's, yeah, there's going to be lore. Um, <coughs> yeah, so, so far, um, this is what basically what what we found out from Akora that up uh, and and Eris that Sauron's alive, so yay, we got her back. Um but we don't know. Wait, like, it's just that there is wait like, so much shit it's been added to this and I'm kinda happy that it's over with. Um so yeah. Yeah, so anyway. I'm letting on too long, my voice is starting to crack. I was going to do another video for Revenant, but I'll probably, I thought I would just mention this as well, because Revenant 2 was a, it is a great game, but it has some, some issues with it. <coughs> like, some of the, wait, wait, for rooting and all that. But I'm going to go back on it, um, to help out one of my friends. So yeah, so. <coughs> anyway, we like, we will comment. Subscribe, hit that notification bell, join the Mighty Legion. Stay awesome, stay badass, stay safe, and I'll talk to you guys um, some point down the week for mini games or well, you might see me playing a few others. But anyway, stay safe, and I'll speak to you guys soon. Bye. Bye.